So I remember a few videos ago how I went to watch the Super Bowl Monday morning and that meal came with a free breakfast. And I was so excited for the free breakfast and it was owned by this uh, German guy that lived in Czechoslovakia and the restaurant was all decked out in Czechoslovakian stuff. Czech stuff now, I guess. I think it was old Czechoslovakian stuff because it was really old. But anyways, um, my point is I was just chomping along in my breakfast and I was like, these sausages are really tender. But weird. And then the more I ate, the further in I got. Uh, yeah, man, I'm, I'm actually gonna might throw up thinking about this and recounting the story. Um, it got really soft, and I didn't really think much of it. But I thought, hey, maybe Czech sausages are just that tender. And I started biting into the second sausage. Now there's lots of mistakes along the way on the story, and one of them is the fact that I just didn't ever look at the sausage as I was eating it, because I was focused, like, on the Super Bowl. Okay, long story short, the inside of the sausage was raw, pink, pork, not pre-cooked, just raw. That was, un that was involuntary, oh my goodness. That's, I just, it's just so gross to think about. I don't know if I'm gonna tell the story. I have a weak stomach anyways. Sorry guys, that was like sweaty. That was unexpected. Anyways, my point is this. I'm sorry, but that was my real reaction. Can't get any more real than this. I should call this show Real TV with Eric, because that was almost throw up on your screen. Um, my stomach's been feeling weird ever since. I don't know if it's actually feeling weird, or if it's just feeling weird because I have this weird, like, hypochondria, whatever, placebo effect, whatever the, whatever the reverse of placebo effect is. Anyway, so I went to the pharmacy today when I was at the mall, and I was like, hey, I ate some raw pork. And the guy looked at me like, um, why would you do that? Because I think I said it in a way that, like, implied I chose to eat raw pork. And I was like, no, 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 no. So I kind of told him the story. He laughed. He started looking at some stuff, and then he was like, um, how much did you eat? And I was like, one and a half sausages. And I realized at that point that, um, that's just too much raw pork to eat. Like, one bite is, uh, acceptable, given the circumstances. Half a sausage is acceptable. One and a half sausages, that's, oh, there it is. Um, one and a half sausages is clearly not acceptable. Alright, here's my point. This is a long story. This is like three minutes video. This is like my entire video, guys. I should just do these, because I think these blogs are kind of interesting. Stories from Eric's State of Life. <sighs> three days of this. Anti-parasite medicine. Because my stomach, that day, did not feel bad, but it keeps feeling a little bit worse. I don't know if it's all the Thai food I'm eating. I mean, who knows? I could have gotten a parasite from somewhere else. All I know is when I lived in Vietnam, I had a parasite, and it almost ruined me. Um, I thought I would die. Um, in Vietnam, when I had the parasite, every 15 minutes, I was crying, ass mini seat, on the floor, bent over in half, as I was sure that my intestines were being eaten alive. Um, and it was that way, every 15 minutes it hit, explosive poop, throwing up every 15 minutes for about a day and a half um, before they finally went away. And that was one of the worst experiences of my life. So to avoid that, I'm gonna, I don't care if I have uh, parasites or not, we're going to uh, have some drugs. Drug time, ladies and gentlemen. All right, peace out. I'm now on my way to the post office again. That was a little miniature story on the way to the post office.